I'm Saray Rowe. I belong to the Yorta Yorta and Kulin Nations and I'm co-founder of TAG, Traditional Aboriginal Games. Our dream is to educate all children across our country on traditional Aboriginal games, our culture, our heritage and provide positive role models for those children. I work um, in the traditional Aboriginal games space in Shepparton for the Academy of Sport, Health and Education and when moving back to Melbourne I noticed that there's not a provider of the traditional Aboriginal games down here. The biggest challenge for me going into business has been um, finding other role models in business. I don't know anyone in business so um, I don't know who to go to to ask questions and um, to find answers. Fortunately I've had a good network of Indigenous women around me that have been able to support and encourage since I've been a young, uh, young girl and um, I had a little sisterhood, I guess, of women that were always encouraging me in Shepparton. I had uh, the likes of Karen Ferguson, Belinda Briggs, Raylene Nixon, Janelle Atkinson, um, just people that I could lean on for support at all times. Also, my mum has been a major role model for me, um, seeing her juggle six kids and um, do her masters, work full time, and um, set the bar really high for me. So far, um, the most supportive affiliations we've had have been with the Richmond Footy Club's Corrin Gamagee Institute, um, going out and providing programs for them and um, their real program participants have been great. And we've had um, the affiliation with the Academy of Sport, Health and Education and their backing is um, really important to us because um, they were the ones who paved the way in Victoria for teaching the traditional Aboriginal games. I think now the biggest opportunity for women, especially Indigenous women in business, is the drive that everyone has and the energy around self-determination. And I heard this quote last year in a um, lecture from June Oscar and it was about hope and um, knowing who we are and all aspects of our identity. We enable other people to have hope and that was the thing that put me straight into business. I was like, I've, I've got to give this a crack because, you know, this is one way that we can be proud of who we are, our culture, our identity and our history.